Hey there everyone, we are back with another Coke Studio Pakistan song from season 15. I don't want to talk about it or give any intro. Uh, 2 a.m. At least share the name. Yeah. 2 a.m. Yeah, that's what I was going to do. 2 a.m. We'll talk about it. I'm actually yeah, lost, loss of, as a, at a loss of words, but it's, it's a song that I, yeah. Leave it there. What we what, what we should have done is uh, recorded at two a.m. Here is like eleven p.m. Yeah, it's eleven but... p.m. Yeah. Should we? Let's let's start. I can't wait, man. Three, two, one, play. Coke Studio, season fifteen. I wouldn't say a word. I'm already speechless. तो खा हर पास दिला बिच चोर रख देने बुलिया ते झूठे हासे हाय तो खा हर पास दिला बिच चोर रख देने बुलिया ते झूठे हासे नफरत दी कोई एक्सपायरी होनी चाहिए सचिया मुहबत दी कोई डायरी होनी चाहिए मुझसमे बना के खड़े करो लैला मजनू दे पूरे शहर च सच्चे आशक दी याद विच शायरी होनी चाहिए ये रूहा वाले प्यार जड़े कर दे सिलो जिस मत पर सिर तते मर दे सिलो यार चले गए ने ओ दीवाने बुझ के सारे ओ परवाने बन गया चाइल्स पे प्यार एक जो सेन चु रखा ना मैं गल करा स्ट्रेट प्यार ते रह गया ए बस गिव एंड टेक दिला दी सौदे बाजी बन गया के इतने शक्लों ने सोनिया पर दिल सारे फेक आदत पै गई पैसे खान दी तके दिन रही कीमत जान दी इस दुनिया ते किवे मैं यकीन करा कोमदा शैतान पाके खाले इंसान दी स्टारशा how do you know i love his mannerism I love his mannerism. Absolutely. Absolutely. Multiple moments of goosebumps. Multiple. Throughout the song, I literally lose count. Lover, the way she is completely. Pele pele dunia de vich jadu aaya insaan si. Te pyar to lava o de kol koi hor na saman si. Te sachche aashkade vas te hi rab ne banaya jahan si. The poetry. poetry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
साथ झूठे हसे हाय तो खा हर पासे दिलों में तू चो रख देने भूलिया तो झूठे हसे What have they created? What have they created? What what have they created? <clears throat> It's actually criminally underrated still, in my opinion. Criminally underrated. I mean, the thing is that there is a certain age group that can actually resonate with it. I I feel like it. <clears throat> the, the 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 substance. of it is such that there is a certain segment that mm-hmm. can actually relate with it but that's a separate matter right? that that's the substance of it <clears throat> we can talk about it i'm very conflicted i'm very conflicted that uh, i mean i as lo- as much as i love this track i as much as i feel that they have created a masterpiece of this season you know probably this would be the track that would be known for season 15 probably mm-hmm. hopefully hopefully there are better tracks <clears throat> for me subjectively you know mm-hmm. very subjective opinions but um yeah i would want to talk about it in a in a more rational manner uh, may, maybe i fail we'll see um anyways anyways man this um you go tell me tell me ah uh, i mean th- I already explained it during the video there are multiple moments of goosebumps I still have goosebumps literally speaking um where to start I mean I I actually went on listening to this track because of Zishan Ali's name yeah but for me the ultimate surprise package was a star sha nothing to take away from Zishan Ali though I am First let me talk about Zishan. So I have been following Zishan since the Nest Cafe based with me. And I love that guy. His his voice he for me personally he deserves a lot of recognition, praise, eyeballs and limelight whatever you call because he has a wonderful voice texture but at the same time he can sing ghazals, he can even do qawwali, he can <clears throat> even perform on the rock tracks as well he is such a refined refined artist such a absolutely refined. he's classically trained and amazing he, he understands he understands his voice he understands his voice through do, do, do you do you feel that uh, he has this <coughs> atala uh, atala is a healthy texture essence of, essence yes absolutely yeah absolutely. do you feel it as well <laughs> absolutely absolutely 100% and i mean a lot of people have covered nusrat fatah ali khan i personally think it it could be my another subjective opinion but i personally think zishan has done not of of course he cannot be nusrat fatah ali khan but the best that tribute that he has ever been given by any singer i probably feel that zishan has always done justice whenever he is covering nusrat fatah ali khan <coughs> i just love this guy i just love this guy i hope that he gets a lot of recognition he is a wonderful singer he just he should be just cherished he is one of one of a kind for me personally but the the winner of this particular track for me was the conversational manner in which they have created yes. this particular track I mean, mind-boggling. The mind rebuttals, yeah, the rebuttals yeah. are absolutely spot on, and the poetry is not just oh. a simplistic poetry, but it has been. I mean, it is depth. simplistic in a manner that you can understand it, but the the depth that it has, as you mentioned, oh my god, oh my god. <clears throat> I mean, I'm just at loss yeah, of words. Yeah. So uh, let me tell you something. You know, when I first heard this track multiple times. I mean, I I felt, and I've always felt that Zishan Ali has this ability to convey pain, pain, or you know, or depression far better. You know, he has this he has ability that. in his voice. Mm. And I thought, you know, what Starsha versus were 
uh, but you know uh, you know it's about the complaint uh, mm-hmm. that you know this is happening in the society and all that and there's this uh, a grievance hidden behind it and Zishan Ali could have done better but but then I started humming this this uh, part from the Starsha you know or I started singing mm-hmm. that part of Starsha I'm, I'm, a, I'm a bad singer but in the bathroom <laughs> right I realized that you cannot hum or sing it without a smile on your face absolutely absolutely 100% this this was such a revelation that 100%. once only once you try to hum or sing it then you would realize that it has to be sung with a smile on your face right and and if you have a smile on your face this this is not an expression of pain hmm. this is this is an expression of fact statements statements right so this hmm. is a statement about the current status of affairs right Absolutely. and and it's 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 a it's a statement of perseverance that you know that this this nation that pakistan is going through i i feel it even though we yeah. are not uh, residing in pakistan these days anymore right there is this depression there is this um, anguish there is this um, this 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 whole bad vibe that is going on around you know um, the the uh, the everything almost every part of life right Hmm. but the perseverance of the people is such that we are surviving every single day the people back home are surviving every single day and if people can deliver the state the you know the state of affairs with this uh, people do you know with a, with a smile on their yeah, face yeah. you know what the things are yeah. so bad you know there, there's so much inflation there's you know hmm. things are so bad we cannot afford electricity with a smile hmm. on your face yeah <laughs> right of course, of course. <laughs> yeah, we, you know we, we find it very hard to um, uh, you know, educate our kids with a smile on their face. So uh, this this was this was such a revelation, and this was done so brilliantly, brilliantly so brilliant. brilliantly. This was this was weaved into the composition so brilliantly. I mean, I I don't want to even talk about the the lyrics themselves. And there's there's a lot already has been said in the in the BTS of this particular video. And I mean, I would encourage everyone to watch that watch BTS that. because that Absolutely. BTS is actually cinema. It's, cinema. It's, cinema. It's, 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 it's cinema of such pedigree that, you know, it can kill a lot of movies. Yeah, I mean, absolutely, absolutely, 100%. We will we'll talk about a little bit, a bit about the BDS, maybe, if we get time. But what I felt in Star Shah's cadence throughout was that he, he is that person who has gone through so much. He has gathered so much wisdom over the passage yeah. of time even it's, it's such a small thing it's one abs- is right absolutely and you see it you see it actually in his mannerism the way he is standing the way he's moving the smirk when he is having the rebuttal with yeah. zishan ali he is just literally kind of laughing at him the, the the voice that he has carried through it was i mean as it you is, said you cannot it, do it without the smile on your face it, it you know it Zishan's um, star Shah, uh, if you watch the BTS and all, he comes across as a very grounded person, grounded, absolutely. as a very you know, um, <clears throat> he's a very down to earth, grounded person. You know, very very simple in his in his mannerism. You know, we we say simplicity favors regularity, right? Yeah. <clears throat> it's one of the principles that we work with. It it comes out. In his in his voice, it, it comes out in his mannerism. It has it comes out in his delivery. It is so grounded. Whenever I mean, he's stating facts that you know this has been going on. That this is the current affair of things. But again, it comes across so grounded, so humble, so humble. Absolutely, absolutely. I I, I just want to mention one specific thing which I absolutely loved. I think that guy. I mean each individual from the sound team to the visuals team they have done a wonderful job they have done so much they have put in so much effort and it's reflected in the bts as well but one guy i want to mention out who i personally loved was valid atik who is handling the synth based part i personally feel that he understood the assignment through and through the, the synth base throughout this particular track was impeccable impeccable for me 
So, uh, I mean, I, it's, it's, I think as I must mention, uh, there have been four tracks already released uh, in the season. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> and 2AM is personally my, my personal favorite, right? Same, yeah. I, I, I feel a deep connection with it and all. But on the other hand, yes, we got to hand it to the coaches team. The thing is, to, you know, to make a masterpiece like this, it has, you know, all the the sum of all elements, all elements have to be have to be greater than the individual parts, right? The sum of all elements have to be greater than the individual parts. So w- whether you talk about design, whether you saw sorry set design of the set, the scale of the set, the lighting, the cinematography, you know the 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 you know the positioning, the the, the soundscape, the the choice of instrumentation, everything. The sum is so much greater than individuals, individuals. including Star Shah and Zishan Ali, right? Mm-hmm. And that is the actual art and artistry and mastery. And I mean, I gotta give it to the whole team, whole team. Uh, and and Zulf, and especially Zulfi for bringing these two together. Mm-hmm. But the whole team. Now, I mean, we can talk about it. each element. Man, is this is, is Coke Studio has ascended, ascended. ascended. They have ascended, you know. They have crossed the borders. I mean, a little little <sighs> attention to details. I'm just trying to point out one incident where each and every person understood their salmon clearly, and it reflects in the video. At yeah. Hats off to the director. The set design was impeccable. I personally, initially, I didn't know that it was actually a set. I thought that it was an actual street. But if you go to the BTC, BTS. You would find out because the attention to detail is so impeccable. One incident over there, uh, the sad state of affair when Starsha is singing is reflected in the background of a bookshop, right? And you can read it actually at the top that it's written Dukan Barai Farokht. So, man, <laughs> you know, th- there are two things I, I wanted to mention. There are two things that actually killed me, that actually brought tears. <clears throat> the first one was that the guy who is sleeping on this, you know, on this tailor. Tailor. <clears throat> on this cart. Mm. The guy who is sleeping on the cart. And the verses that go along with it. I, it you know, it brought tears. It, it literally killed something in me. True. And then, and then you know, the, the uh, I mean, there are, there are bright, there are silver linings as well. There, there are bright elements as well. Uh, mm. But the, the, the bookshop... As an avid reader myself, absolutely. Th- awesome. That oh, that like you know that there was a knife in here. Oh. Uh, that it. I mean, it was it was there. There were highlights while the Shanali was singing. You know, the, the, this this old lady patting the cat. cat. And that was beautiful, beautiful visual. Beautiful visual. You know, and you know, people taking care of each other and all that. They are both side of the coin. But oh my God, this the, we we uh, we often talk about that um, uh, we should always listen to the audio and you know uh, we should always assess the song without the video. But in this case, the audio and the video, and the video, both of them are. I I don't have words. I don't have words. I quickly want to talk about Zishan Ali as well. His verses, his delivery. <clears throat> there was so much, so much honey. In it. I I don't know. I don't know. It was so sheery. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It was, uh, you know, it was it light was at so the end of ca- tunnels. Ca- so calming. It was so calming. It was it was a balm. It was a balm. You know, it was consoling. Yeah. It was so consoling. It was so consoling. It was yeah. like you know, uh, you know, there is there is this thing that. There are some doctors who specializes in, in you know, consoling patients on the deathbed. Hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. And it felt like that Shana Lee put that bomb. Ah. And ah, to, this, support, this, this to support that, to support that actually, because when Zishan Ali, Ali is actually rubbing the bomb on your soul, to support that with the visual, because he's saying, <coughs> so it's not about all bed of roses actually and if you see the love comes in all forms and shapes so there's a mother just ironing the clothes of her kids before the school so it's it's also a form of love a simple act 
So again, again, the depth in each frame. Frame. Each frame, you 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 can watch this hundred times, and there would there would be meaning, meaning, a new meaning every single time. <clears throat> the one you point out about Dukan Brafarokt, you know, Dukan the, the the darkness, the darkness in which that guy was sleeping on the cart, the the, the darkness, the you know the the suffering of it. And on the other hand, the, the 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 woman weaving the you know the braids and all, every single thing, the way the the light was shining on the chandelier when he was sitting, ah, oh. every single detail, <laughs> is so much, and nothing was overdone. Nothing, nothing. Nothing was overdone. Nothing. So that's that's also brilliance and mastery and artistry of of the whole team. That you know, you don't overdo one element. It was, I mean, I can ramble on, on and, and on, on, on and on, on and on. on. But what what I gotta say <clears throat> is that I'm in a state of a part of life where it resonated with me a lot. You know, hundred percent from from all angles, from all 100%. angles. You know, I'm 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 very worried about family back home. I'm very worried about. You know the state of affairs back home. I'm very worried about, you know, climate change and how it's gonna affect back home. You know, there's there's so many elements that you there's this anxiety, but deep rooted anxiety. Yes, yeah. but at, at the yeah. same time, I, I on the other hand, as you said, there are two sides of coin. I have after listening to this track, I also have started to notice little things that are done by the people around you. To support you and we take we take it that, for granted that's how th this is the this is the perseverance this is how you're surviving <clears throat> by Absolutely. actually helping out each other you know helping out each other the the the, the random acts of kindness, kindness that you see every single day and and you know back home especially we are from karachi we we, we can talk in that particular context uh, every single day the random act of kindness that you see is is something that keeps us going Otherwise, there's. No, I mean, the, the people on top are. Are I, I'm not sure. <laughs> Absolutely. Anyways. <sighs> All right. Let's let's conclude over here before yeah. we start to. But but yeah, thank you so much, Zulfi and the team. Of every single person, every single person. Yeah. We we are yeah. probably thinking to um, go through the BTS. We generally do not do the BTS track. Man, right no. Now. I'm I'm You know, it's it's too emotional. <laughs> I know, <laughs> I know. <laughs> we were just discussing it yesterday. Probably, probably we will. We generally don't. But this one is a masterpiece, as Harris mentioned, from all angle. So we don't know. Maybe we will. Maybe we won't. But <clears throat> thank you so much for enjoying this track with us and let us know your thoughts, specifically if you have experienced such things or even the small act of kindness that have made you, yeah, feel better at some occasion, feel hopeless about the humanity in general. We'll appreciate that. Thank you so much for listening with us. We'll catch up on the next one. Take care. Thank you. Bye-bye.